we are back here. He's still in the Great Tower. Orders. Move forward. Alright, so report to Lord Marshal Angar Arandir. It's been a while. I'm trying to remember how to rotate the camera. Okay, there we go. Pray tell. Pray tell what? Got it. Pray tell Mox. That's where I started. No, it couldn't be. Can I loot these things? Now would you look at that? Focus potion, mage's note vision. And gold. And a readable item. Of the, of the Empire. Sorry for anybody getting dizzy. No, Let's you're... see. What? Can you not see I am busy? No, he didn't. Then move along, will you? Come on, Tahar. Let's leave him be. That was... Odd and mildly annoying. Okay, so I can't just. Okay, so I can't even go up that staircase, so that's definitely not the way to go. Alright, here we go. Ready to go in? You sound nervous. <laughs> nervous? <laughs> uh, no. I just. Never mind. Come on, let's go in. The Hall of War is not only where most of Nortander politics are conducted, but also where emissaries and diplomats from other empires are first received when visiting Greykeep. It is easy to understand the reason. Once one has walked on the marble floors, through the gilded arches, and beneath the eyes of the many statues that adorn its giant halls. Okay, then. So where is the Lord Marshal? Well, there's something for me to take over there, so I'm gonna take I that. I said dismissed. But all we need is more time. The cure is within reach, and we... You've had your time, and what did you achieve? Nothing. People are dying as we speak, and if we do not stop this plague right now, it'll wipe out all of Greythorn next. Damn. Once you've found a cure, fine, we will use it. But for now, this is the only way. I... Uh, Understand, Lord Marshal. Forgive me for my failure. Dismissed. Sentenza Noria is the guy I mentioned earlier, hmm. who is voiced by the same guy who voices Geralt in the Witcher series. The only reason I'm taking everything is so I can sell a lot of it later. Understood. Also, if this is where they do politics, then that says a lot about the Empire. About Nortander. Yes. Lord Marshal, General Noria, you wanted to see us? We did. Sentenza? Yes. What do you know about the Bloodburn? I'm not sure what you mean, sir. So, our commitment to secrecy worked for a change. That's <laughs> refreshing. The Bloodburn is a plague. The first time we heard about it was about three months ago. For almost a moon's turn now, every capable alchemist of Greyfell and Everlight has been searching for a cure. And there are rumors that the elves, the dwarves, and even the greenskins are affected by it as well. Problem is, we are nowhere near a solution. And recently, there has been a massive outbreak at a village near Greyfell, Leonon. So yeah, like I said, that is very much Geralt of Rivia. Hmm. Am I right to assume that this Bloodburn is lethal? 
Absolutely. It's by far the most dangerous plague Eo has seen since the Red Fever. It corrupts a person's blood, hence the name. It starts with a light fever and some nausea. Within a week, people will bleed from their mouths and their eyes. We don't know what causes it, and so far, no medicine has shown to help. Once the first symptoms show, it goes quickly. The blood forms blisters, which eventually burst open, and by then, the fever already causes an excruciating pain. After that, it's over quickly. Within the next few days, the victim will bleed out like a slaughtered pig. Tiara's breath. Sounds like an Indeed. Any idea what causes it? How does it spread? Well, that's the thing. We don't know. Some things seem to suggest that it's contagious, whereas some alchemists believe the infections occurred random. At random? Well, not entirely. Apparently there's a pattern, but it seems almost too ridiculous to say it. The infected we've talked to, many of them have reported hearing, I don't know how to put it, noises around where the infection must have taken place. Noises? Yes. Some of them even said hmm. it sounded like a voice. Superstitious nonsense, of course. But it might suggest that it's more than a mere disease, which is troubling. A curse. That is what you're suggesting, isn't it? A curse? No. If anything, I think it might be some kind of magical anomaly. However, you're not here to muse about the courses of the plague. We have scholars. Set courses. Out. You're here because the Wolf Guard will set out on a mission. Sentence. We have to find a way to contain the outbreak in that village, Leonon. If the infections reach Greyfell, we will be faced with a catastrophe that will make the Mage Wars look like a pleasant dream. Thus, we, together with a small division of Nortander soldiers, will travel to Leonon and assess the situation, and see what we can do. I understand. But if there's no cure, how can we contain it? We'll see when we get there. What's my role in this? What kind of question is that? You're a <laughs> member of the Wolf Guard, and this is a royal mission. End of story. If the Bloodburn is deadly, how do we protect ourselves when we get into the contaminated territory? Again, we haven't understood the Bloodburn's distribution pattern yet, so there's a chance it'll not affect you anyway. <laughs> but to make sure, our alchemists have prepared a concoction that's supposed to protect against the infection. You have an inoculation. Supposed to protect? Well... It did work for our scouts. We'll simply have to take the risk. Understood. When do we set out? Tomorrow at first light. Just get your things and your potion from the alchemist downstairs. His name is Albertus de Reims. Then meet me at the gate when you're ready. Anything else, Lord Marshal Arendir? No. Just solve the problem. <laughs> we will. Mm hmm. So I'm just supposed to solve. Sounds like a cursed disease. Let's see. In the midst of the keep, like a lithic giant challenging the sky, stands the Grey Tower. Hmm? Alright, so Albertus is over here. Probably mm -hmm. the guy I talked to already. Now, now would you look at that? Are you Albertus de Reims? Depends on who's asking. Corporal Carpal and Corporal Tahar, Wolfguard. We were told you can give us a medicine that can protect against the bloodburn. Ah, oh, so that's you. Yes, here are your potions. Drink two sips of it two hours before entering the contaminated zone. It lasts for about seven hours. And it works? Of course it works. <laughs> Just make sure to never go over my suggested dose, otherwise it can be lethal. Now, is there anything else? No, that was all. Thank you. Everybody's so... Everybody's just so impatient these days. Can I go, can I go up those stairs yet? Nope. Alright, so, time to reach Leonon. Understood.
Let's see. No city of Nortander evokes as much awe as Greyfell and its guardian keep, the seat of the crown. Built into the Hibernian ruins that once crowned King's Mountain, its walls and towers were made to withstand every foe and army, from the great orcish horde to a swarm of dragons. It was here that the Mage Wars came to an end, after an unknown rebel warned the crown of your father's planned attack. You remember the battle that followed all too well. Though many soldiers were honored for their bravery, no amount of medals will make you forget the widow's cries at the funeral pyres. Yeah, that's a fun one. Navigation could be easier in this game. That's it, lads. Keep at it. the others. We have a long journey ahead of us. So tell me, Tahar, is it just me or has the general changed? Now that came out of nowhere. I mean, back when I joined the Wolf Guard, he was so different, passionate about our cause. But now, I don't know. Well, the war did take its toll. Yeah, you know, like, it just doesn't even let me fit in. Doesn't even let the conversation finish.
right, so now we're heading to Vietnam. Overrated the region. World map is any time in the game as long as you don't control the current active RTS base or cutscene is playing. And the glow button, top right corner of the screen. See? Oh, cool. Battlefields, Cruiser Faction. Huh. Alright, so Anselm is. I forget. He is. a tank. Okay, so. Warcry to Taunt. Noria is. Is it two? Is it dual wielder? Wide swathes of green, fertile soil, lakes and rivers rich in fish. The people of Leonon, a small village in the meadowlands of Leonida, have long led a peaceful life. Now the tides have turned. According to word of mouth, the village has been struck by the blood burn. It is your mission to ascertain these rumors' veracity and act accordingly. All right, then. So our job is to see if this if there actually is a plague here and do what we need to do. Hopefully I don't have to burn the city down or, some, or the, the town down or anything, so. I'm saying is that I just don't understand why people always act that way. I mean, I... Quiet. We're here. This is Leonon? Huh. Looks pretty serene. Still. What about our troops? Should we wait for them to catch up? No. Our first task is to assess the situation anyway. How bad is it and how many are infected? Once we have a clearer picture, we'll act accordingly. Meaning? We'll see. Hmm. <laughs> Take the bow. Orders. Go to Bertrand. And there we go. What's next? I kind of prefer the blackened staff, if I'm honest. Yes. Hmm. Made up your mind. What is it? Orders. Double checking that I got that I got the selection done correctly. Giant spiders. Now would you look at that? Venom sack and chitin shell. 